Hello, I'm Thomas Hartmann, a software engineer at the Qt company. This video shows how easy it is to create user interfaces for embedded systems using Qt. In this demo, we use Qt Quick Designer, a tool to create graphical interfaces with QML. It's part of the Qt Creator IDE. We create a coffee machine user interface as an example. The UI of our coffee machine consists of several screens. The use case is the following. First, we select a the coffee, then we adjust the coffee, and finally, after inserting our cup, the machine brews the coffee for us. The different screens of the UI are modeled using states. Each different screen is defined as a separate QML file. We lay out the components horizontally to be able to later animate them for the tree transitions. Let's test the application. I press the play button to deploy the demo from the host to an our target device. Now I can enjoy my coffee. The logic of the UI is mostly implemented in one single QML file. In this file, we trigger the transitions between the states and also define a couple of animations. To allow this, the screen components export subcomponents that we can access to implement QML signal handlers. Each screen can be created using drag and drop just using the designer. To model the different levels of coffee and milk, we use a combination of clipping, anchors and bindings. For anchor margins, we have to use expression to model the desired behavior. If we change now the value of a slider, we immediately see the update in the form. This is extremely useful for fast iterations. On the final screen, we use different state to achieve the different coffee levels for the animations. The actual animation is defined by sequential animations. I hope you enjoyed this demonstration. We showed how to create the user interface of a coffee machine using Qt Quick and Qt Quick Designer. Qt Quick and Qt Quick Designer maximize your productivity and maintainability.